Wayne will be involved more than ever. Thank you. Thank you and salute to you, bro. Make sure y'all subscribe to his channel, man. Y'all follow this man, what he's doing for the coaches. Priceless. Generation X, you know we like to flex. Gen we slack, like, 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 you know we like to flex. Yo, yeah, yeah, we strictly break it next. When we roll down the street, people rally want to check. Huh, rally, rally, smoke weed in the alleys. Salute, what's good? Welcome to Gen X Media. Y'all already know what time it is with me. We on real nick time. Tap in. Your man Skip Bayless has been looking for a new co-host since Shannon Sharp resigned, left, moved on to greener pastures, all that. We still waiting for an announcement of what Shannon got going on and coming up next. But it's looking like Wayne might be a little bit more involved and undisputed moving forward as of what Skip Bayless had to say. Now, this wasn't a design meeting or a setup meeting because they get together at least every three to six months at Wayne's house and all this other shit. But it's looking like that this is an attempt of a rollout to fill people out to see how they feel or how the audience reacts to Wayne possibly being in that debate seat across from Skip Bayless. That's how I feel anyway. Now, even if that don't work out, ESPN just laid off a gang of motherfuckers. Skip Mike can pick one of them to sit across from him and then Wayne chip in in the show here and there more than he typically has over the years. But let's hear from Skip and y'all let me know down in the comments how y'all feel if Wayne does take that seat across from skip how that will work out y'all hit that like share subscribe i'll catch y'all next time be easy wayne will be involved more than ever in undisputed going forward so will young money i love you ma'am